It is a widely known fact that lures love eating ugali and fish. As a matter of fact, some not only love the food but are also very selfish with sharing the meal even when dining with family members. In Mount Kenya, natives are turning to fish. Many people love fish meal. But what do you know about fish? At the market, on the road, in the lake, and finally served for a meal. To answer these many questions, Farmers TV visits the lakeside to begin telling the story of the whole fish chain from the fishermen. Today we are at Dunga Beach at the lakeside city. We are looking at the fish business in Lake Victoria. It is 2 in the afternoon and the fishermen are mending their nets, some preparing their different fishing gears in readiness for the overnight exercise. At the sunset, when many people return home from work, these men row their boats. It is time to ride or sail far into the lake for a proper catch. Here are the fishermen at work. I've gone to school. Maybe first born is in university, Nairobi University. Fishermen have become so many. Stock marriage dog chien, kaluore gi yedi ngeng. In the past, the boats were less. Nowadays, it's the opposite. This means we have to go further into the lake because the fish stocks are just not enough. Yes. would go for many hours in the night. After a long night expedition, fishermen return to the shore. Boats with different catch, for example, Daga. Daga is the famous Omena in the Lu language. Nile perch or boat, still in the local dialect, and many other species arrive at the beach. It is a beehive of activities here at the beach. Fishermen meet with the fishmongers who have come to purchase different catch. In fact, sometimes it is your strength, in Kiswahili we say, mwenyanguvu nipishe, that will make you get what you want. Some people begin simple processing right at the lake. Some take the fish directly to their local markets. Okay, Others are taken to the nearby restaurant and hotels as a large bulk leave the lakeside city to Dika town for industrial processing. That marks the phase one of our fish supply chain story. I mean the introductory episode. Keep watching because in our next series we look at fish after reaching Nairobi, what happens at Gikomba Market and many more activities. 
For Farmers TV, I am Malakai Motano.